23-year-old Creadona Murak, who is a postgraduate researcher in Galway. He recognises the importance and the value of starting a pension early for security in retirement, but says realistically he simply cannot afford one at the moment. It's rent, gas, electricity, groceries, and then anything after that is a complete bonus. So whether that's social life, whether that's you know the likes of paying for the car, um, that is like that's where our priorities end. And he's not alone. According to new Central Statistics Office data on the level of pension coverage above and beyond the state pension, a third of the working population aged between 20 and 69 here last year did not have a private pension. The lowest level of coverage remained among those aged 20 to 24, where cover is only 25%. That compares to nearly three quarters of those aged 55 to 69. Two fifths of those surveyed said affordability is the main reason why they don't have a pension, and a further 45% claimed they had either not got around to organising one or would get one in the future. The data comes as the government continues to work on long awaited plans for pension auto enrolment something that's not now expected to come into force until the end of next year. We know that automatic pension enrolment does increase um, enrolment rates and coverage rates of private pensions, particularly for those younger workers who say haven't gotten around to organising one. But there also is going to be a group who do face a genuine issue and and tension between whether they're saving for a house deposit or whether they're saving for retirement. There is a lot to be worked out. They're giving themselves, I suppose, 18 to 20 months to do it. What we'd like to see now is action and we'd like to see a proper plan and a proposal put forward. So plenty of work still to be done then, but further clarity is expected to emerge when a memo is brought to Cabinet in the next few weeks. Will Goodbody, RTE News.